lot of my work on this channel, you'll notice that I often import images of furniture or other kinds of things to save time. The Insert File tool under the Actions menu is the feature that allows you to do this. Images may be inserted from either iCloud Drive or other kinds of cloud services or directly from the photo library. With the image imported, you can either select the object by using the freehand mode in the traditional Photoshop ring of marching ants, or you can use the automatic mode, which allows you to select the image by tapping on areas of similar color. Once you have selected as much of the object as possible using this tap method, a single swipe will allow you to remove the object from the background and paste it back in on its own layer. To be honest, this method is much trickier and does not always work, as you can see right there. But if you play with it a little bit, you'll get better at it and find that you can then isolate the image the same way you did before. Once the object is selected to your satisfaction, activate the Transform tool to place it in the right position. The Transform tool also has a freeform or magnetic mode. The difference between the two modes of transformation is subtle. The freeform mode allows you to individually move any corner of the rectangular selection. The magnetic mode of transformation allows you to make adjustments to the size while maintaining the proportions. But here's where the nuance comes in. Magnetic mode also allows you to tap and hold to select a single corner, but only to change that corner in a rectilinear path. It's not easy to explain when this tool would be your tool of choice, but I can only say that I have used it to great effect. The last step in our process is to use the freeform tool to get the approximate size of the couch we want, to use the horizontal flip tool to reverse the direction of the couch, and finally to change the color of the sofa in the adjustments menu by using the hue, saturation, and brightness sliders to get the exact color we want. Thanks for watching, and as always, let me know other areas of interest you have in the comments section below.